if you ask people doing skill farming whether it's profitable they're going to tell you it's not profitable because they don't want you to do skill farming because the more people do skill farming the less profitable it gets so it's kind of like the oz effect <laughs> it's kind of like the oz effect except uh with skill farming in, in reverse so you don't want anyone to know whether it's uh whether it's profitable so what i did is uh what i always do is i created a little spreadsheet which is a very simple calculation and i wanted to know how much money can you make uh, skill farming and so uh, i'll show that calculation and then uh, maybe we can have a discussion because there are some uh, there are some nuances that you can uh, uh, you you can uh, you know also do to kind of tweak your profits like sales and cere cerebral accelerators etc so um yeah um so let's actually let's make this even bigger so you all can see so something like this right oh that is not what i wanted to do i want to do this let's center this a little bit so this right here right is my uh, my calculation and um i'll i'll walk you through it um I'll walk you through it and uh, uh, and then uh, uh, we can we can talk about it, right? So skill farming return, right? This is with uh, using current prices uh, of, uh, of of items. So if you're talking skill point output um, per month uh, for a, an Omega character, then uh, that is what you're talking about. This is not using cerebral accelerators, not using cere cerebral accelerators. Um, your your revenue is going to depend on how many large skill injectors can you fill right so skill um for those of you that don't know skill farming is all about um generating uh, sp and then pulling it out of uh, um, your characters that have more than 5 million sp using skill extractors now you need to buy those skill extractors um and they're going to cost you money right um and uh you need to buy plex uh, because you need to buy um your omega subscription and you need to buy your mm, multiple pilot training certificates if you want to uh, do this on three characters which this calculation says you should be doing because every character makes money and um considering all of that uh means that your total expenses so your your skill extractors and your plex is going to be 2.3 uh, billion for the first character 2.2 for the second and so on so in total you're going to have um 6.8 billion a month in expenses so you can see you can already see this is going to take a little bit of um uh, of investment capital right <laughs> if you're just starting out this is probably not for you um so revenue your revenue is basically your your large skill extract extractors so i um uh i took um um i took uh the uh the lsis uh, i assumed uh, because i see that question in there from noima of course i did um um there is a a deal for 1120 plex for 10 skill extractors um and uh that is the cheapest way of getting them and i considered that noima thank you for that question it's a very good question but yes i'm happy to say that i did consider that and also i also considered that um that you're going to buy and sell everything in perimeter in the triple t right because if you're doing this in jita then i can um immediately tell you that this is not going to be uh, this is not going to be profitable, right? Um, and so uh, yeah, so uh, the the question is: Is this uh, maximum LP one nine seven six? This is Omega and plus five implants. Yes. So this this right here, uh, the SP gain is uh, Omega uh, plus five. Um, So this right here um, is uh, uh, is uh, is the question. Your your math is messed up. You get three only, so a count is nine, not eleven. Your math is messed up. You get three only, so a count is nine, not eleven. Whole numbers. 
Yeah, no, you don't because ugh, Jesus guys come on you get uh, If you break it down per month, you could also you could also say um, <laughs> that, Come on, dude, like if you if you uh, if you would stop at three, that'd be ridiculous because you don't. You keep on going. So the only reason this is uh, this is taking fraction uh, is because taking a fraction is because uh, you have to take some kind of time frame to calculate it. Obviously, you just keep going, and at some point you have four. So, but yeah. Um, okay. Um, th this is correct. Um, and so what what this turns out to be um is uh yeah exactly stop at three and then stop doing do not go on um and so um this is <laughs> okay now we're getting into february that's right um i i calculated with 30.5 days by the way <laughs> um yes halt um so so yes before you say anything i i i entered this i entered this this whole thing i entered with the caveat of saying there are certain things that are going to sway this one way or the other like cerebral accelerators like sales right and also um uh login rewards are on top of things right i am not going to consider um uh I, the, the 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 way you calculate the spreadsheet is not considering everything uh, that is possible out there, right? Because you don't have to, right? You only have to uh, consider the most likely scenario, and based on that, you can make your own decisions, right? Um, and if you have little loopholes, then you have little loopholes, and it's fantastic, right? But I'm going to put the general case out there with an omega plus five implants and 30.5 days a month right and that means that your profit is going to be 139 million on the first character 188 million on the second 188 million on the third and so your total is going to be about 500 million per account right and so um this is um this is not uh, crazy um i have been told that it used to be a lot higher and uh, obviously looking at uh, you know plex pricing and 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 skill extractor pricing it's easy to um uh, to see that it was right but even at the current rate um this is uh, not bad because you have to consider um that um uh that you have to consider that this also gives you an, an omega account basically a free omega account that you can do something with right so you could if you wanted to you could do pi on the side or you could do um uh, um you could do you know whatever uh, you use your uh your your uh, sino alts or whatever it is that uh, that people use omega accounts for uh, is do exactly that but yeah um also trading that's right you could trade with this account um so it's actually it's not bad um i should have prefaced this with I should have also prefaced with this with, hey, if you're watching this and you create a skill farm, you better use my referral code, bitches. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna put this here. I I promise I will raffle away the proceeds, but you better use you better use my promo code if you didn't know it was profitable before and now it is. All right, I, I I'm gonna be mad if you don't. Um. Not being critical, I would like to learn. What is the value of using 30.5 days? That is 0 0.5 days that won't train. Would you try the math using 30 days? Sounds... Um, uh, yeah. Uh, 30.5 days is because... Um, uh, you know, just because some months have 30 days and th some have 31. And then you have leap years, of course, uh, with the February. And, uh, uh, you know, we can use uh, we can use 30. Uh, let me uh, see here. Um, I think up here somewhere, I probably have 30.5 here. We'll do 30. There you go. So with uh, if we have 30 then uh, that's 448 million um uh, i forgot who asked the question um nick paw um good good question 
if you have 30 days um so uh it's 448 million i don't think it's going to make uh the so whether you calculate with with 29 30 or 30.5 days um i think it's not going to um make you uh um decide on whether this is valuable or not so the the difference uh is about between 450 and 500 million yeah <laughs> thank you sand <laughs> but uh remy main has a point if plex is worth for 30 point 30 days then uh, uh we might as well put um uh, put 30 days in there yeah so um this uh this right here uh is um whether you know whether whether you have uh uh whether you agree with one little number this is this is uh this is the triple t uh discussion all over again right the uh, remember when i put out the the infographic uh on um uh how much revenue the ttt makes i may be right about one thing i may be wrong about the other one it doesn't matter because it makes a lot of fucking money uh so uh with with skill skill farming uh let me just you know put it down to the basics you're gonna make maybe 400 maybe 500 million uh with with the if you looked at this two days ago it was actually just uh 300 something million because plex and skill extractors um um uh, actually um fluctuate a lot uh and they're all going down right now so it's gonna be long uh um it's gonna be down sand four likes nitpicking that's good dude. nitpicking is good um and so yeah so um one thing that you guys are rightfully saying also is what um i mean not considering i think the fact that you have an omega account then is important right you can't just ignore that fact all right be, uh, before i forget this by the way guys there is a um there's a raffle going on right five minutes on the raffle make sure you exclamation mark raffle for a uh, an aeon share worth 130 million um this is this is going to fluctuate whatever right but this is enough for you to make a decision because the decision is do you want an extra omega account do you not want to pay for it then do this <laughs> right if you if, if that's what you want to let me talk about prerequisites though right um prerequisites are important because a you're gonna need a lot of money to set this up right you need to buy plus five implants. And for the next stream, I'll have that calculation on what the initial investment is, but you're gonna need plus five implants. You're gonna have to buy a bunch of Plex. You're gonna have to buy a bunch of um, uh, multiple um, um, pilot training certificates, right? You're gonna have to buy a bunch of skill extractors. You do all that with Plex. So just, you have to, you're gonna have to buy a lot of Plex. And if you don't wanna uh, give CCP money, which is, uh, you know, probably your initial um, motivation for all of this, then you're going to have to have um, money, uh, uh, capital in game to do all that. Um, and so your return on investment is going to be kind of shitty, right? <laughs> it's going to be kind of shitty and it's going to take a while. Um, uh, my guess is, uh, um, you know, it's going to probably take like four or five months or something. I haven't, I, I simply haven't done the math. Um, but, you know, we've, uh, as I said, this was kind of a spontaneous decision to show the spreadsheet to you guys today. And so the next time I'll have a, an investment, um, uh, an investment uh, in there. Uh, so if, if an, an investment calculation, yeah, <laughs> like if, if all you want is a return, then, um, you know, and you don't have the cash around, then probably it's better to invest it in the market. Um, but you know, if you have cash lying around and you wanna you wanna tr uh, mess around with this, and this is this is your base calculation. 